Marissa Graham has fair skin that burns easily. When she wants a tan, Marissa sprays it on. I think I look a lot better when I'm tan. Once a week, I probably put it on to give myself a little more color. Consumer Reports checked out six self-tanners, ranging from about $8 to $35. To test, a panel of volunteers wore patches so the skin underneath could be used as a reference. Then testers applied tanning sprays or lotions to the volunteers' arms all contain dihydroxyacetone, a chemical that reacts with the skin's outer layer to create a darker color. It takes about four hours to really get the full effect. And then you need a second follow-up application about a day later to get really the, the deep tan you really are looking for. When the patches were removed, Consumer Reports experts compared the skin underneath with the skin that was colored. One lotion produced an orange color that was sometimes streaky. It's Banana Boat Summer Color Self-Tanning Lotion. Another problem? Odor. Some of them didn't really smell so great. But testers did find a favorite. L'Oreal Sublime Bronze Self-Tanning Mist in Medium Natural Tan. It gave the most natural looking results for around $10 a bottle. When Marissa Graham spray tans, she says you can really see the difference. When I wear like white dresses in the summer, this kind of makes a more contrast that makes me look better.